Hey guys, uh, what's up? Uh, I was just gonna air out the, uh, crusted gecko eggs that I have, and it turns out that one of them is growing mold. So, I'll try to see if I can let you guys see that right there. Let me turn on the light, hold on. But if you look right there, it's that one right there. It really, you can tell, it's really, it's really yellow, it's like an almost orange. Yeah, but it's, the woman that I got her from said that the last pair of eggs she got were infertile, last clutch. But, yeah, this one looks a little bit yellowish, right, this one right here. But this one's definitely done, I have to throw that out. Um, yeah, but I think these three will turn out. These are perfect. These are nice and white. These are huge, too. They're, like, the size, almost the size of my thumb. Like, if you look at it next to there. They're pretty big. Um, but, yeah. I have to take all those, those, um, that one egg out. I'm not really gonna empty all this out, because I think it'll be fine, but pretty sure that's all I have to do is take that one out. But, yeah. When you got to see that, wanted you guys to see that. Uh, I'll do another video on what the female looks like and the female both of these, and then my male. I'm gonna breed them tonight, actually. But yeah, they they're due to hatch anywhere from the 17th on. But uh, yeah, till really yet, probably somewhere between 17th and the 30th of November. But um, yeah. I mean, not the 17th, the 7th of November on, anywhere between there, because it's, it's not that cold in here, but, yeah, I really want, I really hope this one turns out okay, because I saw the male that she was bred with, and I'm really curious about what they're going to turn out, but the, the ones that laid these, I'm not, I'm completely, have no information as to what she was bred with, so, it's like, oh, uh, it's not the way, so, so they have I really want them to hatch, but yeah, it happens. I'm gonna keep trying until I get fair legs. If this one doesn't turn out okay, but all right, that's it.